the brass is just a town in the middle of nowhere really it's kind of a pretty small town but uh, when the World Cup came out it seemed to everyone seemed to come out and the streets were pretty crowded and a little festival going on it seemed and it was pretty rad they had the track just going down like natural stuff like natural features going off little rock walls and through people's it seemed like through people's gardens and stuff all right yeah we need to like the uh fast speed like jumps yeah is it just kicking like, you still yeah. is it yeah okay it's fine. yeah Oh, no. Did it kick you everywhere, Matt, or just, um... No, no, just you know. I mean, it's at high speed, isn't it? It's all high speed. Yeah, yeah. One, two, three. Yeah, should be good. Kind of uh, ballsy yesterday. Looks pretty simple, but well, I think it's going to be harder when you go try going fast. But it's just pin it down the grass in your tight body armour skin suit wearing jersey that we're wearing for this weekend. So I feel like Popeye. Look at them guns. Got a muscle back. <laughs> I don't really use them for anything other than riding, really. But the French are pretty strict in the glove rule, so... <laughs> Gotta wear these. The crowd are actually crazy. Was, even in qualifying, it was, felt like race day, just lined the side of the track, top to bottom, and they'd shout and scream. And you know, there was a lot of Brits there as well, actually. So you know, it wasn't just a bunch of Frenchies cheering for you. So, uh, but no, I, being honest, I'd say it's pr probably be up there with Fort William, really spectator-wise. Maybe not as much spectators, but definitely as loud. Do you want something for the front wheel, mate? Uh, yeah, maybe. That's better. Good. I fucking stepped on a swamp. Yeah. <laughs> my foot is like soaking wet now. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, well. It smells like piss, too. It's probably fucking. It's probably piss. <laughs> Defo Defo piss. Alright. Terry up, man. Oh, well. Yeah, I met this little kid that uh, got named after me like the first year. Uh, first year we raced here, old nine. This little, like this guy came up to me with a little like a baby suit and he's like, oh, can you sign this for Muffy? And I'm like, I was a bit confused. And then he was like, oh yeah, I named my son after you. I'm like, no way. As far as um, racing went, it was, it was over before it even started. Like. I got to the first boardwalk, it was raining a bit and pulled a tear off and it 
it um it, it, it like the rest of the terrorists just popped out and after that I couldn't see and that was it end of the story. Yeah, any times or anything yet? Nope. Do you want to know? And then what I need to be? What I'm gonna be? We'll find out if you want. Yeah. No. Nope. Yeah, just mm -hmm. do, ride your own race, man. You know you've got it in your legs. Uh, yeah, I guess so. Not bad result. 21st. So for close to top 20. Kind of gutted I didn't get inside, but uh, fastest junior. So getting up in the overall as well. But I'm not really thinking about that at the moment. Just another good, another good quality and uh, finals on my belt. So. Definitely peaking for Worlds, but gonna have a good what three, four week or three weeks to Worlds. So just gonna train and do loads of riding, loads of sprints, and just kind of be ready for Worlds, I guess. But got a cup, got a race next weekend in Italy, so maybe if I do well there, it'll give me even more confidence. So, but yeah, everybody you know did pretty good this weekend, and everyone's in a better mood, and we're all moving forward. So. Yeah, couldn't. Yeah, I guess couldn't really ask for better. Run was okay, so it's all right. Got two choices, Simo. Think of something nasty and times it by ten, or give us one of those Mark Cavendish sprints right down to the cross. Get them off. All the best, Cavendish. Mate. Yeah. Pinned all the way, mate. It's good. Friggin' was fast at the top, was moving, but then uh, just had a bit of a bobble at the bottom. Lost. Well, even if you lose that much time, you're off the back. So ended up 24th. Best result of the year, so fairly happy. So close to the top 20, so no stoke. I think uh, Lewis and Joe did well as well, getting in the top 20, so I think they're pretty stoked. And we're all getting there. Yeah, I've been, been riding good this week and it's nice to actually get the speed back. So uh, try and build on it this next week. We're out in Morsey and filming with MTB Cut. And uh, yeah, get a bit faster and then smash it about us all. 15th, yeah, it was 16th. Unfortunately, Pete got DQ'd. So I went up to 15th, but uh, yeah, I'm happy with that. It's about time I had some good luck, I think. And not really down to luck, I think. I had a pretty good run. Didn't have any major issues or anything rode it fast like I know I should be able to. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that, so it's more of a kind of track which I think should suit me, so uh, yeah, it should be good. I think we're kind of getting into it now and looking forward to it. It's a bit of a longer track, so we'll see. Yeah, well that's what I'm going for now. Like, I'm not really going for the overall not but I just want to get some decent, solid results towards the end of the year and just keep me going to, into next year, really.